In this video, we cover how to install the Omniverse Launcher, as well as a few applications on Linux. First, download the launcher to your system. Then, launch the installer. And once it launches, you should see the launcher appear on your desktop. By default, it will start in the News tab. You can navigate to the Library tab. This is where your installed applications will show up. If we go to the Exchange, this will allow us to find applications to install. Let's select Create and install it locally. While it's installing, you can take a look at the description of the product, the version number, the system requirements, as well as some resources at the bottom of the page. Now let's go into the Connectors section and find the Maya connector. Let's install that as well. Finally, let's go into the Collaboration tab. We can add a local server. And the process of adding the server will install the Omniverse Nucleus. During the installation, you'll be asked to create an administrator account and complete the setup. This Nucleus server will allow you to share files, sync files between different applications, and also give you access to the samples that come with Create. Once your applications are installed, they'll show up inside the library. As you can see, we have the connector installed. We can review the version number. By clicking on Settings, we can go make sure that our install path for Maya is correct. And this is also where we could go to update it in the future. Now you can see Create has been installed as well. This is where we go to launch the application. You can go in Settings once again and see where the install path is and launch the application. If we had multiple versions installed, clicking on the menu next to the Launch button will give you access to those different versions. Because we installed the collaboration service, we can see a local host server available in our list. If you go in the NVIDIA folder, you will see assets, materials, and samples that are provided with the source application. We can go into Samples and load one of the sample sets to make sure everything's working correctly. First, you'll notice the geometry and lighting, and then the materials will start to appear as they load. Have fun exploring the sample scenes we've provided.